Hi guys, welcome to the Algotest tutorial. So this video is going to be in English where we are going to talk about how you can design your own strategy in Algotest platform and start running your strategies. So we are going to talk about each and everything like connecting your broker, which plan to buy, how to add the strategies, how to execute the strategies live, how to backtest the strategies, right? So this is going to be a long video. So let us start. Now, first of all, whenever you want to start your algo trading journey, you can use the link in the description below. I have shared the algo test sign up link. So once you click on sign up, there has to be, uh, you can add your name, mobile number, password and everything. So once you have added your name, mobile number and password. So basically first thing you have to do is add your brokers. Now in the broker setup, there are a lot of brokers that can be added. For example, five pesa, AC Agrawal, Alice Blue, Angel, First Talk, Dhan, Choice. So there are a lot of brokers that can be added. And for each broker, there is a different setup. So for example, if you want to add JM Financial example, you can click on setup and then you, ha you have to ask your RM for the API activation. So here the complete process of each and every broker has been mentioned. Ki what is the process of adding each and every broker, right? So just go back here. For example, if we take the example of flat rate. So in flat rate, what do you have to do? Here are the complete steps. So from step number one to step number six, you have to follow this, add the API keys, add the API secret and connect your broker, right? So once you have connected your, connected your broker, then that is the first thing. Afterward comes the pricing plan. Now to start running the strategies live, you need to buy a credit package here. Algotest key sign up link I have shared in the description below. You can use that special link and sign up on Algotest platform. If you want special strategies that can be run freely from my side, which can be run, then you can message me on WhatsApp as well as you can comment, put the comment in the comment section below, right? So if we look at the credit package here, there is a starter credit package of around 400 rupees plus GST, Explorer, Pro and Advanced. So basically, if you want to buy a cheaper package, then you can go for Pro plan where it only takes around 0 0.8 rupees per credit. So generally I suggest people, uh, generally I suggest traders to buy a pro or advanced plan only because it will save you a lot of money compared to the starter plan, which, which will approximately cost you approximately 480 rupees, 40, 400, 400 plus 20%, 18% percent GST basically, right? So this is how you can buy a plan for the running, for running the strategies. Now comes the algo trade. So currently some of my trades are running live where I have got margin shortfall in one of my accounts and some of the trades are running live here, right? So how do you design a strategy? Now basically go to new strategy section here on the left hand side, you can see a new strategy section. I will click on new strategy and firstly, you need to have a basic logic of the strategy. What do you want to do? Whether you want to buy a call, sell call, whether you want to sell a straddle with certain stop loss or whether you want to, uh, let's say, a sell a triangle with certain point of stop loss. Now here I am selecting the index of bank nifty in bank nifty index. I have, let's say I am entering a starting time. So here are the parameters which can help you to define the timing of the strategy. So what should be the entry time and what should be the exit time? So these are the entry settings. Okay. Now you can use no re-entry feature. Let's say that you don't want any re-entry after one o'clock. So what do you do? You can just click on this no re-entry after and just click on 30 and just enter the timing here, right? So we have discussed about the entry settings here. Now the instrument settings here, I can change the indexes. If I want to trade in Nifty, I can select Nifty. If I want to trade in Bank Nifty, I will trade, uh, select Bank Nifty or Fin Nifty, Midcap Index or Sensex. Keep in mind that uh, let's say the newer indices of Sensex, Bankex and uh, Midcap Index will not have much liquidity on normal days compared to the expiry where the liquidity will be abundant. So always remember that select the indexes in such a way that there are no liquidity issues and you don't get stuck in certain position. Afterwards comes the leg wise settings. So if you are a person who wants to trade a strategy, let's say that after hitting one side stop loss, you want to move the stop loss of other leg to cost, right? So in very simple language, let's say that you have sold a hundred rupee call and a hundred rupee put. Now for this, you have kept a 25% SL initially. So the stop loss will be 125 here. Here also the stop loss will be 25% and the stop loss will be 125. Now, what if you want that after hitting the SL leg one, you want to shift the stop loss of 125 to 100, then you can use this feature of move SL to cost after trail SL to break even price basically, right? And you can also click on the I button to understand each and every logic of the strategy, basically the features of the Algotest platform, right? Now moving forward to leg builder. So basically we can add legs here. We will add two legs and collapse this. Now 
let's say that you want to create a short position so what do i do i can change the number of lots i can select the lots here 2 3 4 whatever lots that i want to trade uh, I, i want to trade then click on the position so this is the position where i can select whether i want to sell or whether i want to buy now select option type whether i want to sell call option whether i want to sell put option and expiry weekly monthly or next weekly strike type is so here there are a lot of strike types that you can select select strike criteria so first will be strike type now strike type strike type basically means if you want to select atm otm1 itm etc right so these are the strike types now it the second thing that comes is closest premium now if you want to select a premium let's say 100 rupees i want to select a constant premium that is near 100 then i can use closest premium but if i want to define whether i want to select premium less than 100 or greater than 100 then i can select premium greater than 100 premium less than these are the two signs where you can select specifically the value of lesser than or greater than 100 or let's say 50 or 40 whatever the value that you want to select here now next comes the premium range for example if you want to select the premium from 50 to 100 basically so any closest premium that will lie between the range of 50 to 200 that will be get that will get selected so generally what what i suggest everyone is always select strike type or premium values basically and the other things are generally not required so let's say that i select closest premium near 100 right moving down we can change the target of the strategy if i want to add uh, let's say 10 points 20 points 50 points target i will just select 50 points or if i want to select percentage i can select percentage now here there there is an option of adding underlying points and underlying percentage as well means if you, I, if i want to select 50 point movement in the in the index right if i want to select 50 point movement in the index i can select underlying but generally we do not use underlying because underlying strategies will have a lot of slippages so use only points or percentages whenever you are trading using algodes platform or any other platform where you are using algos right here i can select the stop loss whether i want to select point stop loss or percentage stop loss that can be decided upon your requirement whether you want to select percentage or point here the trailing stop loss value now generally most of the people do a mistake of putting a stop loss of 1, 2 or 1, 3 or 1, 4 you have to be always you have to always remember that first value always has to be greater than the second value and always use higher point trailing stop losses generally stop loss of 2, 1, 3, 2 0.5, 0.2 these kind of stop losses don't work don't work in real market because of slippage so it suggested that you at least use 10% or basically 10% or 10 points stop loss trailing stop loss with five basically 10,5 10,6 or 20,10 these kind of values should be used for trailing stop losses otherwise your stop loss values are not going to uh, otherwise your live trades are not going to match now here there is a feature of reentry on target where you can use reentries on target let's say that you want to re execute the strategy on target or whether you want to reentry the uh, reentry the strategy on target here comes the re entry on sl now if you want to understand what are re entry and re execute there will there are separate videos that are available that you can watch in detail manner to understand what are re entries and re execute in algo test platform right so i can use here re re execute or re entry here basically to re entry the strategy here comes the re simple momentum simple momentum means wait and trade where you are waiting for the premium to increase or decrease by certain points or percentage let's say that i want i am trader who wants to buy or uh, who wants to trade let's say uh, waiting for the premium to rise i want to buy this call when this call moves uh, this 100 rupee call moves to 120 so what do i do i wait for premium increase from 100 to 120 that is 20% right so i will wait for 20% or 20 point increase here i can see 20 percentage so simple momentum 20 percentage i can use so that i will wait for the premium to rise by 20% and then only the strategy will start here right so this is how you can start building a basic strategy now there is a range breakout feature that can be used if you want to do option buying or option selling using using range breakout then definitely you can enable this feature and uh, start running the strategy 
बट यू के नॉट यूज सिंपल मोमेंटम एंड रेंज ब्रेकआउट टूगेदर तो इधर यू कैन यूज रेंज ब्रेकआउट और इधर यू कैन यूज सिंपल मोमेंटम एज ऑफ नाउ सो डिसेबल सिंपल मोमेंटम एंड एनेबल रेंज ब्रेकआउट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू ट्रेड रेंज ब्रेकआउट स्ट्रेटेजी ना इफ यू वॉन्ट सेपरेट वीडियो ऑन रेंज ब्रेकआउट बिकॉज ईच एंड एवरी कॉन्सेप्ट विल रिक्वायर अप्रोक्सिमेटली टेन टू फिफ्टीन मिनट्स वीडियो Uh, then only you will understand it in each and every concept of let's say simple momentum trailing stop loss uh, range breakout strategies in a very detailed manner otherwise this video will take around 2 hours to complete everything right so here we discuss the crux of the strategies how you can design the strategy now we have added call sell we will also add a put sell here right so we are adding a target stop uh, recost on one recost on sl target 30 point stop loss basically here i will just select 30 point and just trailing stop loss of 10 comma 5 okay so this is just a dummy strategy that we are running as of now uh, to back test now to back test any strategies it will require you one credit to back test one for one uh, one uh, one time basically one strategy will require one credit so if you need to buy a credit plan here currently i have taken the unlimited back test plan that is available in the algotest platform and that is quite cheaper compared to the uh, limited back testing plan right so here we see the strategy we are where we are selling the call and put uh, sorry i think so there's a double okay let's dis, delete this now so right now i am running the strategy so running the strategy will take other time and i will just select zero dt now why we have selected zero dt because selecting zero dt means we only want to run the strategy on the day of expiry whatever the day of expiry it is for that particular index right i can select the zero dt to one dt two dt three dt four dt whatever i want to select here basically that is absolutely possible but if you want to run the strategies specifically for specific days then definitely that is possible in this platform i can also select week days let's say i want to select this strategy only on friday let's say right so i can run the strategy particularly only on friday and back test the strategy here here you can clearly see all of the data for the strategies such as overall profit number of trades average profit per trade win percentage loss percentage average profit of winning trades average loss on loss trades max profit of single trade max loss in single trade basically all of the stats that are required to understand whether a strategy is profitable or not right and you can also run curve fitting analysis and run 10000 simulation to understand what is the max drawdown of the particular strategy that you are running here here below there is a full report of every day where it shows you the trades of the strategy whether the strategy uh, what was the entry what was the exit what was the pnl of that particular leg and what was the net pnl of that particular day of that particular strategy here so this is how you can understand the strategy this this shows the equity curve of the strategy where you can see the equity curve of the strategy and so currently i have made an entire portfolio for the, uh, running the strategies here so current pnl currently i will just show you what is the pnl that is running here so here as you can see m to m graph so in the m to m graph i can see what is the pnl of the chart what is my current m to m of the combined strategies i can clear i can also see the m to m of individual clients that you are having let's say if you are trading on multiple accounts in one single algo test account then you can see the you can see the m to m chart of that particular day Uh, so that you can understand what was the max pnl as you can see max m to m minimum m to m what is the max drawdown that is faced on that particular day right so this is how you can design the strategy on your own and start running the strategy now how do you run the strategy live in the live market so basically what do you have to do you have to go and click on let's say if you make one single strategy then you can click on activate firstly you have to click on setup execution so click on setup execution generally what do you do you have to select the quantity multiplier here in the multiplier you can select the number of lots that you want to trade trade monitoring trade monitoring what do we do trade monitoring we generally do on ltp basis so that we can get better results in the live trading generally for option selling i suggest all of my clients to use uh, trade monitoring on ltp basis only leg 1 nrml order generally we use nrml order trigger or target price reference always we use trigger delay entry by 0 second entry order type limit order buffer type points ya fir you can use percentage trigger buffer zero limit buffer 3% or 10% anything is fine in entry you can use anything that is not an issue now majorly the exit order type always has to be limit order buffer points has to be percentage limit buffer has to be 10% convert to market order has to be 1% and frequency monitoring is continuous frequency is 5 second just i will wait for this screen you can take a screenshot of this particular page and understand this is the 
हंड्रेड परसेंट बेस्ट सेटिंग्स टू अंडरस्टैंड टू रन अ स्ट्रेटेजी इन द लाइव मार्केट राइट दिस इज फॉर ऑप्शन सेलिंग स्ट्रेटेजीज वी आर नॉट डिस्कसिंग अबाउट ऑप्शन बाइंग स्ट्रेटेजीज बिकॉज ऑप्शन बाइंग स्ट्रेटेजीज कैन हैव सम डिफरेंट मॉनिटरिंग ऑफ कंपेयर टू एल यू कैन यू ऑल्सो यूज ऑन कैंडल क्लोज सो ट्रेड मॉनिटरिंग ऑन एल यू कैन सी स्ट्रेटेजी विल चेक ओवरऑल सेटिंग कंडीशन ऑन एल स्ट्रेटेजी विल ट्रेड अंडरलाइन टारगेट मोमेंटम ऑन एल strategy will execute leg wise reassap and re momentum on ltp only so these are the basic settings that will help us to understand what are the basic news uh, basic use of the execution settings now after you have used the execute uh, set up the execution here now you have to just click on activating the strategy so once you click on activate strategy let's say i select the activate strategy if i have not set up the execution i have to set up execution first then i have to select uh, select activate strategy and i have to select the broker that i want to select that i want to run the strategy in right so this is how you can select the broker whatever broker that you want to run the strategy now let's say you design a portfolio okay so how do you design a portfolio how do you run a portfolio so let me just show you the backtest pnl of my beta expiry basket which is an excellent basket that i am running almost made 5% in this uh, in this month currently in the live market right so let me just show you the beta expiry basket live result on a capital of 1 lakh rupees so the purpose of the showing you the strategies is how you can design the strategies on your own export the strategies and again run the strategies in the live market so the currently the portfolio is running now if you are someone who is a beginner and wants to start algo trading algo trading link is there in the description below you can message me on whatsapp for starting to start running the strategies if you want some help then algo test sign up link is there as well as whatsapp link is there in the description below you can message me on whatsapp to start your algo trading journey so here you can see that on a capital of 1 lakh rupees after adding minimum 1.5% slippage so always remember that you have to add minimum 1.5% slippage on algo test platform to to make money basically so this is the live result that you have to select that that you have to understand after 1.5% slippage only always remember option selling strategies will have a minimum slippage of 1.5% and that is the minimum slippage that you should consider whenever you are back testing a strategy right so in the live market we have made a return of approximately 5000 rupees using this particular basket as well uh, okay now moving forward how do you export the basket below is the option to export the basket there is an option to duplicate the basket there is an option to update the portfolio right so if you click on export the basket will get exported so here it has got exported now how do you import the basket if you want to import the basket just click on import here click on browse file and whatever basket that you have exported you can just click on import right and click on open that basket will get imported on your algo test platform so how do you run the strategies live so just click on portfolio and click on activate so individually you do not need to activate every day all of the strategies just make a portfolio of the strategies and click on activate and all of the strategies will get activated accordingly so here i can change the number of lots if i want to trade two lots if i want to trade three lots if i want to trade five lots i can change the number of lots here the base multiplier you should always remember that the base multiplier should always be one so that you do not get confused how many lots you have to trade and just click on active selected activate selected by changing the broker of uh, the, by changing the broker here right so this is how you can uh, make a strategy in algo test platform buy a plan and start running the strategies on your own in this platform uh, around 50 20 25 brokers are supported particularly on this platform and you can start running the strategies live basically if you require any help you can message me on whatsapp whatsapp link is there in the description below sign up using the algo test link for special offers and special strategies if you want to join our free community where i share all of many of my strategies free of cost where i share every day my pnl as well as tips to start your algo trading journey then algo trading community link is there telegram link is there in the description below you can join this link using this link thank you do share this video with all of your friends like and subscribe to the channel thank you